me and <laughs> I have a workout video <laughs> which is currently playing right now um, guess what I'm singing if you can guess what I'm singing then uh, <laughs> that would be funny um, but I've tried to do a workout video um, so it's a bit talky and a little bit silly so I do I'm doing first is I'm stretching out both of my arms. This just really, uh, you can really feel your muscles stretching and there's a little bit of stretching in this video so hopefully it's, <laughs> it's okay to watch. I usually double or triple up on everything so it turns out to be a 45 minute video or a 45 minute workout, sorry um, so, um, so I'm doing it quite fast at the moment um, so I'm just stretching out my neck going round and round and I'm gonna go the other way and this just really, really gives it a nice stretch, ready for any workout that you're going to do. So we go up and backwards on the neck, and up slowly and to the side, and to the other side. We're going to do little circles now, and I usually do these for about two minutes each. Um, going forward and going backwards, and try and get your both arms on the same angle, because mine aren't in this. Um, but you can really feel the burn in the inside of your arms, so it's really... It's a really nice workout if you're tightening around there. Home workouts are so fun uh, because you can do whatever you want and you can stop whenever you want and you can be doggy, you can wear what you want, you can go naked if you like. I mean, some people would do that. Um, but you know, you're in your, you're in comfort of your home. So uh, we're going to wriggle it all out, stretch everywhere. Okay, so we're going to work on our shoulders now and going backwards first on each arm. And then we're going to go forward too and also separately like I'm doing. So forward separately on each arm. And remember you do about two to three sets on these. And forward on both. Just releasing those muscles. And then we're going to do a nice stretch on your arms again. So putting your hands on the back and stretching. You'll be able to feel the burn there as well. Stretch, stretch, stretch. And on the other side. Stretch, stretch, stretch. Forward. Okay, so we're going to wriggle that all out again, and a lot of this is out of focus, so I apologise again. This one is just a quick stretch. You do this on both legs, I'm only showing it once. And then we're going to be more stretching, especially on the legs and the arms. So stretch up high in the air. And then you're going to go down to the floor. If you can, you'll feel it really burning if you've never done it before. But just keep stretching down like I'm doing. Try and touch your toes. If you're quite flexible um, and you've been doing a lot like I have, uh, you can eventually you'll be able to put your hands on the actual floor. Um, that 
burns very much um, but it's really good it's really good to stretch and you'll feel it all at the back of your legs I promise it's really beneficial when you do this you'll be able to see sort of results and flexibility in a few weeks or a couple of months depends how long that you do it for again stretching out and then going down onto the floor and you really do this when you've had enough of feeling the burn okay so this is like a side stretch so you're just putting one hand into the air and one down you can actually do it on the other side of your arms so you can put the arm that's raising up in the air um, diagonally to that foot and then same on the other side too but we're just keeping it uh, pretty easy today okay so stretching still feeling that stretch feels really satisfying when you've done a workout Okay, so we're going to go down onto the floor for a little bit now. And I'm going to do these leg raises. Uh, so get into the same position as I am. You might want to get a little bit lower, which is what I will do in just a moment. Like this. And you're just going to put your thigh up close to your upper body and stretch out your legs. So in, out. as well um, when you kick it out. I filmed this about three times so I was all sweaty and hot so <laughs> I couldn't really be bothered with the third time but do keep your legs stretched out um, if you want to see nice results. So I usually do that about 30 times, uh, two sets don't have to do it all at once um, but do 30 or do 15 take a deep breath and do another 15 or get swap sides from left to right okay still staying on the floor you can get a better view of me now we're going to be doing some sit-ups I actually really like sit-ups um, I can do lots of them for some reason um, but I like doing them and um, I've heard stuff that they're not good for your stomach, it doesn't do anything for your stomach, but um, it has helped with me, so I think it just depends on uh, the individual, I guess. So, just putting your hands to your ears and then stretching up. Um, you can also do it without touching your head or your ears as well. Okay, so I'm going to do more stretching and I'm going to get a little bit of water. You guys saw this in my August favourites. It's really great. Okay, so we've got lanky long legs here. Uh, <laughs> um, so we're going to stretch on my legs down on the floor now. I love doing this one as well feels really nice. It burns, but it feels good. Okay, so going to the middle now. Really feeling that burn. Feels really good. I should try it. <laughs> so trying to get to the end of your foot or your toes. It's a really big achievement when you do it. Okay, so there's another little workout. So just wiggle your legs and your hands. And now we're going to try and place your head 
on your thigh, keeping everything straight. Don't let any part of your leg uh, level up. Just go down as far as you can, putting your head down. Really, really feeling it now. And then we go to the other side. And we do that again. There's always one leg. That's always harder than the other one. And that's this one. It usually takes a while to get down to the bottom. Okay. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. <laughs> We're going to do front wave now. So try and stretch right out to the end of your toes and then again also try and get your face down to your thighs as best as you can just do it in the same position as what I'm doing whatever you feel comfortable with that's, that's the only real thing here Okay, so what we're going to do now is we are going to do leg rises. So keeping your legs straight, you're going to go in a crouch position as well. So just like I'm doing in the video, legs stretched out and when you get a little bit more advanced with it and you feel more comfortable doing it, you can lift your leg a little bit. And again, I do about 15 of these in three sets. So it gives it a nice little workout. And then we switch to the other leg. I'm wearing Adidas uh, pants and just a black top. I have quite a couple of gym clothes, so I might show you guys when I do a more advanced techniques next time. If you guys like to see me do a yoga one, uh, I might be able to do that, so comment down below if you'd like to see that. Okay, so now you've done that, we are going to do uh, little girly push-ups. <laughs> Again, this is really only easy peasy type workout. Um, do more advanced later on uh, in another video. But you want to do little girly push-ups if you can't do uh, where your foot's your foot's actually down on the ground. Normal push-up. Um, so it's just the same sort of thing, really. It's just a lot easier because you've crossed your legs, so you've got more weight. Um, you've got more weight down on the floor than without it, so it's a lot easier to get down. Onto the floor. Okay, so we're nearly there now. So we're going to do a little bit of a Pilates. This one really, really kills. Um, try and do this for about two minutes. I was really hot and sweaty so I couldn't do it for very long at all um, so you can put your bum up into the air um, at first but you need to gradually go down a little bit more and it really tightens your bum your thighs your stomach area um, so if you have any problems with those areas I recommend doing like Pilates okay so we're back on our feet now and we're going to jump up and down, and this bit's a little bit out of focus, so we'll have to wait till it goes back in. But we're just going to do a little bit of jogging, just on your toes. And I was listening to Elvis here, so I got a little bit <laughs> intrigued with putting my arms up, so put your arms up as well. In the next fitness video, we're going to be using weights because it's a lot better. So do a little turn around to 
get in with the song and again a little bit faster and you do that for about 10 minutes okay so keep jogging keep jogging all right so then we're going to be doing star jumps so aim for about 30 of those in three sets because they're pretty easy to do and it feels really good too because you feel like a child here we go i think we're getting back in focus now <laughs> Keep yourself steady and immerse yourself into it. Alright, so we're going to do squats now and these are really good for your bum. Um, so we go down like this and usually I've got weights in my hands. Um, so we're going down and then up. Supposed to keep your back a little bit straight, and I don't really have it completely straight here, um, but this will do for now. <laughs> and then I'm singing again, and <laughs> uh, I'm so dorky. <laughs> uh, so we do a little bit more squat. I really like doing these, they really, really make your bum look really nice and lifted. And they're really good for your stomach too and obviously your thighs because you're going down on your thighs. I think. Oh, maybe not. <laughs> I don't even know when I finished. All right, we haven't finished yet. We're going to wiggle around and we're going to do some punches now. So, put your legs down a little bit lower. So just crouch down a little bit, and you're going to punch. You just watch me from the side. Punch, 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 punch. I used to do Taekwondo when I was a little child. And this is one of the things that we had to do. But we had to actually punch the foam thing. Oh, it's a nice workout. And then we're going to do some kicks now. I wasn't really sure what I was doing here. I was trying not to fall. Just lifting your legs up, getting the flexibility going, jump and a kick, and then kick, kick. Okay, so we're all done. 